Hello friends, welcome to Civil Engineering Exam. Today we are going to see the problem related with wastewater engineering in the topic of sewer design. So the problem, calculate the velocity of flow and discharge in circular sewer of diameter 1 meter laid at the gradient of 1 in 500. Use Manning's formula n equal to 0.012. Assume sewer is running half full. So the given data is uh, circular sewer and the diameter is uh, 1 meter and the gradient S equal to 1 in 500. Then N value is 0 0.012. Then uh, <coughs> sewer is uh, running half full. So now uh, the solution. So the Manning formula is V is equal to 1 by N into R power 2 by 3 into S power 1 by 2. So now the hydraulic mean depth R equal to A by P, the, we know the formula A by P, area by perimeter. So A is equal to area, the P equal to perimeter. Now uh, the sewer is running half full, so uh, we have to find out the half area, so into 1 by 2. So we have to put 1 by 2 over here. So the now sewer is running half full, so R equal to half into A by P. So now uh, the area value, so area is equal to pi by 4 into d square and perimeter is equal to pi d into uh, theta by 360 so into 1 by 2. So now we are going to solve uh, pi by 8, so the 2 into 4 is equal to 8. Uh, so the pi, the pi will be cancelled and uh, diameter and uh, d, uh, d square d will be cancelled and uh, the theta is equal to 180, so 180 divided by 360 equal to 2. So 2 and uh, 8 will be cancelled and uh, remaining is 4. So now we got the value of d by 4. So r equal to d by 4. So the given value s equal to 1 in 500. The slope is 1 in 500. And n value also given 0 0.012. And diameter is given. So we are going to substitute all the values over here. So v is equal to 1 by 2. 0 0.012. So the n value. And r value d by 4 into uh, 2 divided by 3. Uh, into And the slope s equal to 1 divided by 500 into whole power 1 by 2. So now we are going to substitute uh, d is equal to 1 and we got the value of uh, v is equal to 1.47 meter per second. So now we are going to find out the quantity. So q is equal to a into v, a area into velocity. So the area is equal to pi by 4 into d square and uh, the sewer is running half full. So uh, we have to put 1 by 2 over here into the velocity value we found that uh, 1.47. 9 so uh, finally we got the value of 0 0.581 meter cube per second so this is the uh, final discharge uh, in the sewer 0 0.581 meter cube per second so this is the method to solve the sewer problem again we will see next video thank you